Hi, my name is Bethany, and that's the name I prefer to go by. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky. I was born and raised here. Um, the pronouns I choose to go by is she, her, and hers. One of the areas that jumped out to me was um, the trauma-informed care. Working as a youth counselor in a residential facility and as a mental health tech in a psychiatric hospital. We've had multiple trainings on trauma-informed care and that's what we use and implement in those type of settings as I'm sure that in any mental health setting um, is more than likely used. I think some of the topics I'm looking forward to learning about is um, the psychosocial assessment because this is where you get to really um, dive into your client's history and get to know them um, in order to figure out where to start um, as far as helping them and to come up with a plan. Also, um, I'm looking forward to learning about the termination phase because working in the mental health field, especially in a long-term um, setting, is sometimes difficult for the worker, client, or both. I know, um, particularly in my first mental health job when I was a youth counselor um, at a facility, those kids that we had, we had there for six months to a year, sometimes longer. So <clears throat> you see these kids grow <clears throat> in their treatment and as well as in school. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I mean, you grow attached to them, obviously, in a health, you have healthy relationships and boundaries with them, but you can't help but to care for these kids once um, they leave your care. Um, and sometimes it's harder for the clients to end that kind of relationship. Um, so just kind of um, learning how to navigate that um, and prevent those kinds of situations is what I think would be helpful. Um, what I hope to gain from this course is better problem solving skills. I don't think mine are terrible, but there's always room for improvement um, and also implementation.